Lexington firefighters are back home after helping with recovery in Mayfield. Yeah, a group went down Saturday and came back on Tuesday. LEX 18's Austin Pollock talking with one firefighter who has been to other disasters, such as that condo collapse earlier this year down in Florida, as well as hurricanes. And he is live in Lexington tonight with more. Austin. Well, Nancy, Larry, you know, I spoke with Captain Ryan Hoxton with the Lexington Fire Department who told me when he got to Mayfield, it's just so hard to put into words the way he best described it was it looked like someone had Legos or Lincoln logs and someone just came in and pushed them straight to the ground. Again, so hard to put some of the video and the pictures we've seen into words just so difficult. Here's some of the pictures that firefighters took while they were there. Hogson says they were specifically assigned to the candle factory to help with the recovery. That includes making sure everyone was accounted for. And he told me while well, this damage, of course, so terrible and life changing for people in western Kentucky and beyond, he finds some comfort in how communities are coming together in times of need. The community will always come together. It will you will see how strong a community is or how weak a community is by the time that uh, something like this happens. Mayfield, Dawson Springs, they've got a strong community. Well, of, co of course, he mentions Mayfield, he mentions Dawson Springs. I can tell you, I was in Bowling Green over the weekend and I was in Dawson Springs uh, yesterday. Also went to Bremen, that was over the weekend. Same situation, many, many strong communities coming together to help one another. And Hoxton also talked about what President Joe Biden said when he was in Kentucky yesterday. He said, in a time like this, when there's so much damage and destruction, there's no blue states, there's no red states, it's people coming together. And he said, that's exactly what we need right now. Again, citing the need for that love and people coming together. We're live tonight in Lexington, Austin Pollock, LEX 18 News.